Hello everybody from Plant Reviews, today is the 15th of April and I'm uh, talking in this video about Muscari Grape Ice. Uh, I planted it uh, in a pot but of course uh, you can uh, grow it perfectly fine in a, a garden. Uh, this is a, a plant that is a variety from the species, obtained from the species Muscari Latifolium. Muscari Latifolium is a, a species from uh, Turkey, uh, grows in in uh, western and central Turkey at altitudes about uh, 1100 1800 meters and uh, it is a um, flowering plant in the family Asparagaceae and uh, like uh, all other muscaries uh, they are commonly called the grape hyacinths because uh, the uh, shape of uh, the flower uh, arrangement kind of resembles vaguely a um, upside down uh, bunch of grapes. Uh, in this one is Latifolium grape eyes actually the uh, shape is uh, more linear rather than uh, triangular a little bit like a bunch of grapes however this one I think yeah, this uh, uh, flower stem resemble a lot more uh, an upside down uh, bunch of grapes. Uh, this uh, uh, scientific name Latifolium in Latin means broad leafed and as you can see the leaves are actually quite broad indeed. They are green usually uh, each bulb produces only one uh, leaf sometimes uh, two and they are drawn together and kind of hood at the tip as you can see uh, the tip of the leaf is uh, kind of uh, hooded. The size of this plant uh, is uh, quite variable uh, it is between 15 and 40 centimeters tall uh, the wild species even if uh, uh, Muscari grape eyes uh, um, usually is uh, about 20-25 centimeters at the most and indeed my uh, the muscari in my pot they're about 25 centimeters tall. Uh, it is uh, a plant that uh, is not uh, really common to find in garden centers but it's not uh, uh, impossible to find in garden centers. However, you can uh, find it quite easily online. I brought uh, these bulbs from Flower Gracie that I found a very good uh, bulb suppliers and uh, it is an online nursery in Netherlands but still uh, is able to uh, import to the UK and um, we don't need basically any health certificate because I think they provide the health certificate uh, possibly in um, for the whole lot of bulbs they are imported in the UK and then they are uh, divided in different suppliers anyway when I, I, I it is possible to uh, from British gardeners for British gardeners to buy bulbs uh, from um, Farmer Gracie and the bulbs come from Netherlands and you don't need any phytosanitary certificate when you buy them uh, from Flower Gracie. Uh, the um, plant uh, is uh, a plant that produces uh, a, a flower stem that is a racine. Uh, it is an arrangement uh, where uh, several flowers are arranged on the central uh, stem and uh, here as you can see all the flowers come from the uh, main stem. The, um, probably it would be easier to show you the color here. In uh, Muscari uh, latifolium, the wild species uh, is uh, very dark purple in the lower um, flowers, that are the flowers that actually are fertile, while the flowers at the top, the florets, uh, are sterile and are uh, kind of lilac or pale blue. Instead, in Muscari uh, grape eyes, uh, they are almost white and uh, the color contrast is actually quite striking. You can see a certain variability here you see this uh, um, flower uh, stem as florets the sterile flowers that are uh, really white while these are there three in the middle they are kind of uh, very 
very pale blue possibly they will become even whiter in the next few days when the flowers reach uh, age uh, a bit uh, once the, uh, the the flower itself uh, the uh, single flower is uh, kind of bell shaped and uh, um, when they dry up they are they dry obviously they will become brown and see the pods start uh, developing you can see here a, a mini seed pod developing from this uh, flower the plant is a, a very easy plant to grow it is hardy from usda 5 to 9 and uh, it is um, even if i found some sources uh, actually uh, state that the plant is hardy down to my uh, down to uh, usda zone 3. anyway i found that can stand temperature um, down to minus 20 degrees celsius and this plant also got the royal society award of garden uh, merit uh, the cultivation of this uh, grape hyacinth uh, um, is uh, uh, pretty much uh, the same as uh, other species of grape hyacinth it loves very well drained soil and uh, uh, full sun or at least partial shade uh, this is a plant that blooms in uh, early to mid spring so in uh, UK between late March and uh, April and uh, this plant also um, needs a very well drained soil because the bulbs might tend to rot especially when they are dormant in summer the plant in this is an active status of growing from uh, late autumn to late spring but goes dormant in summer and in the summer if it is cultivated in pots basically doesn't need any watering if it is in the garden um, ensuring that the bulbs are planted in well drained soil about 5 10 centimeters deep um, the bulbs anyway will uh, not rot because the water will go through the uh, very well drained soil and will go down deep down without uh, water logging the area close to the bulb uh, about the fragrance the fragrance is it's nice but very 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 faint it reminds me really of uh, the hyacinth fragrance but at a at a much lower intensity so this is definitely not a plant i can recommend uh, uh, in a fragrant garden if you really want a uh, plant that uh, uh, perfume your whole garden but uh, uh, it is definitely a striking plant for the garden I think the contrast of uh, the uh, very very dark purple flowers against uh, the um, uh, white sterile flowers at the top it is absolutely uh, stunning it's still a bit expensive but uh, um, muscari usually multiplies quite readily by offset so you should get a good number of um, muscari grape eyes after a few years as usual i hope that you enjoyed the video uh, if you have any questions of course uh, uh, please uh, leave them in the comments down below and i will be very happy to uh, answer you as soon as possible uh, i hope that you enjoyed the video thank you very much for watching of course if you like this video would be great if you can please give a thumbs up and if you like the other videos uh, on my channel as well would be great if you can please subscribe it is completely free for you but in this way you um, make youtube aware that you like my uh, youtube channel and youtube in turn promote my channel on the platform thank you very much for watching and i hope to see you next time bye